Hello, this is J9LP and the last time on Lunar Nights we got some elusive items thanks to changing the weather and we also got some hidden items hidden in the back and we also managed to get for a date using not stone golems who are a bit daft and um, we fought up all this the approach to the dark castle and um, now we are going to be facing the boss Ooh. What kind of boss will we be facing here, hmm? Well, who knows? Will it be one of those Chimera type creatures? Will it be a cow with the head of a monkey or something? Well, let's go and find out, because we're going to be fighting... The... the Paul Brigade. What? These guys? Jeez, these guys are freaking useless. Jeez. Seriously? Oh, okay, one of them hurt me, but, you know, they're practically dead. Jeez, they, they, they just don't self-destruct me. What's wrong with that? Anyway, let's carry on. Or, or not. Oh, great, he's even more useless jumping at it. What kind of... Seriously, look! They're, just, they're all dead instantly. Uh, oh, okay, alright. This requires a different approach. Um... Ouch, okay. Okay, these guys are hurting. Um, they're still pretty much all dead though. There you go. Done. Right, now can we- OH SHIT! Um, okay, we got a mixture of the useless and of the very dangerous. Um, hmm, I think I'm going to have to do this. Can I do it? Yep, let's do this, baby! Num! Let's just crunch these babies, baby! Crunch, crunch, crunch! Yeah! Let's go! I, oh, oh wait, oh never mind, we turned back. Um, and who's this guy? I mean, didn't I see that purple thing before? Who are you? Yeah, basically, no, I didn't see him until now. They saw a hint of him on the, um, uh, on the train, but this is the first time I've actually saw this guy. I am Polidori. An emissary from space. Are you an immortal? I am one of them, you could say. The immortals are made up of those who govern the cosmos. Govern the cosmos? Yes. Feel free to choose whether you believe this or not. Still, I am surprised. Granted you have the cooperation of the Terrenials, but I never imagined you'd be such worthy foes to the vampires and their tools. I imagine you're like rats, cornered, fighting for your lives. But don't you find it all a bit pointless? Humans and vampires have fought one another since the days of folklore. Sometimes the humus and humans are victorious, and sometimes fortune favours the vampires. But their fortune favours the pet 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 Sorry. <laughs> Hard to say that, but in the end they always destroy each other. A cycle with no end. What purpose could there possibly be behind such a struggle? Imagine, if you will, a utopia free of conflict. Isn't it a goal worth working towards? <laughs> Your psychology won't work on me, Buster. Are you trying to tell me that this town is some kind of paradise? Living like a slave with a cowl around your neck? You call that a utopia? The life of the individual is not the issue here. We must consider the future of this planet, of the entirety of the cosmos. Those who cannot do so have no right to govern over this world. But let us leave this matter be for now. This is as much a test for the vampires as it is for you. I look forward to watching your continued struggle. Alright, oh, go and clear off. I'm already being just watching rather than being involved, I think. Thank you very much. Immortal. And, and here's another thing. An immortal, what does that an immortal know about chopping straw anyway? Seriously, I. Oh, well, no, I. I'm no philosopher, so I wouldn't, shouldn't really be asking such questions anyway. <laughs> Even though it's a 44. Anyways, there is the Dark Castle August, which will be our next destination. But. First, a bit of um, 
sure we're going to right. Um, which one are going to put the dental store? Welcome. Hi. How can I help you? Oh, well, you don't mind if you want to buy some stuff from us, do you? Um, namely, this um, lovely ruby. It matches your eyes. Oh, there you go. Um, and uh, I'm actually thinking about it. Let's just. Um, you know what? You can have that as well. I don't particularly need it. All this. Yeah. If you got room to sp um, uh, spell sell anything, um, uh, it's advantageous at this point. Anyways. So. What would you like? I was a your accessories because sometimes you get new um, uh, items and uh, things that I got into the game, including oh, this thing here. This costs 9,999 bob and it will um, uh, double earn soul but prevent you from earning any experience, which essentially means you get double the cash but um, uh, you won't be able to level up. So you would. Um, it sounds like a good deal, does it? More cash, but no um, uh, experience points. Oh, I don't know, I'll leave it up to you to decide. Oh, we got nice and matching Hellsberg, Hel Helge boots. So they were the young guards. But I might not be quite nice. What I will be doing is buying junk parts. Yes, I all need a fair amount. Um, you don't have to sit there and watch all this. So I will see you in a bit. Wait, what the? Oh, sorry. Uh, yeah, we moved shops off screen because I need to get more of these um, uh, materials as well. So um, uh, I've pretty much spent almost all of the money for that. So now, let's get out of here. See ya. Bye. I'm popping over to Professor. Sheridan's. So I'm going to do a couple of things. First off... Welcome. Hello. What would you like? I would like to enhance my weapons, yes, please. Sir. Which weapon would you like to strengthen? I would... Well, um, I'll stop with this silly voice now. Let's um, uh, do some more of them up here. So... Good to leave up this one. As much as I possibly can. Possible. Okay, and let's see, maybe even this one. Nice, and perhaps even. Well, I think I've watched my limit. Oh, wait, no. Ah, okay. I'm going to try and go in here on the more often as possible because there is a certain limit on the, to the amount of materials you can carry. So it's more advisable to come here as often as you can to um, uh, sort of level up your weapons as long as you have enough of the materials. Anyways, How can I help I'd you? also like to change the climate. Yes, sir. Which climate do you want to change to? Do you like to change to um, uh, the tropical rainforest for now? I've it in. Ooh, you hacks all with you. Ah, uh, anyways. So now we're getting out of here. Thank you. When did you really, what did you really care? Are you aware of what? Uh, oh, I've, I've spoilt it now, haven't I? Don't worry, she just says so herself anyway. Um, so just another prof. We'll be going back to this place here. Center Cecilia Station. Because there are a couple of items that I can get here. And also, be another really decent place for all of them up. Because right now, um, you are so powered up right now. I'm uh, can essentially take these guys on an instant, even without a murder power ups. Turn the one around here. Yeah, just sneak behind him. <laughs> um, yeah. Nothing. Um, even these guys. See that? Two hits in there, down. Uh, a lot more difficult on the uh, floor. And uh, don't forget some uh, decent um, uh, special jump parts from them as well. Um, which I might show you later on, but you don't have to sit here watching me go through this again. I will meet you at a certain point later. Hello! 
We've just arrived at platform number four. Uh, we were never able to actually explore this area because we were uh, being chased by robots who would um, uh, insta kill us with one shot. But now um, uh, they seem to have um, all been exploded. You just got these um, uh, guys to deal with, aren't you? Uh, much less of a problem to deal with. Nash. And uh, they even give us junk parts, which in this case is. Mithril. Now, they will actually give you another um, uh, junk part as well, which. Oh, I can't really use the Toby because my life is full. But uh, i stick with this guy for now. Yeah, yeah. Trash these guys with that hell. We're raising. No, I can't shake this. Try to kill this well, I'm a little bit shocker as well because my gosh, I have been collecting so much stuff. Jeez, I'm collecting merchandise here. Look at look at me flipping. Look at that. There's we've got like um, uh, the great Duke photograph and the poster girl and some jewelry. Yeah, we're going to be all loaded on that one. This is going. I can assure you of that right now. Um, anyways, um, I haven't really come here to um, talk about shopping. Oi! Come on. So I haven't been here to talk about um, that, that kind of stuff. We were here more to talk about what you'll find up here. And actually looking at it, it's kind of... Oh, it's not too bad. Let's see how I can get in here. Let's get in here and see. Oh, well, no. It's kind of hot and it's kind of dry, so we need to do something about that. Oh, are we? Is it going to change? Is it going to change to our favour? Good. Well, we'll come back here later on in the month. Let's just have some fun fighting a few monsters here with our new powered up weapon shower. Yeah. What the Spiders Let's get these chubby spiders first, come on. Alright, come on. Ouch okay. Lucky shot. Ha! Oi! You said you could get a word in. Seriously. Okay. Place these guys. Well, it's still wet. Where are you? There you are. <laughs> Didn't even break a... Wait. Um... <laughs> didn't break a sweat, but I'm, I'm almost broke my bag. <laughs> okay, let's get this lot. Collect that. Um, maybe possibly even collect that. And uh, now we can go in here. And it's now... Full on the wet, which is excellent because we couldn't get through here before because we didn't have as well. Oh, no, sorry, I didn't do this. We can now run over this plank and get a new accessory, which is um the need hogger arms. I hope I pronounced that right. You'll be those um uh, god names are a bit weird. Anyway, so this will give you right up the six under rainy skies, which we could do it right now, really. But, um, no, God, I'm just collecting these things for completion, really. Anyways, um, now we've got what we come here for. We'll be able to go through the rest of this, and I will see you somewhere else in the next video.